Hey everybody, it's Cloak It's Sierra, and welcome to my now decorated the video area. <gasps> I forgot to plug in my lights. Uh, there we go. Look how much more festive it is now. Perfect. Today I have a snack fever box, and I'm so excited because I missed making a video for last month's box. I just got really excited and like dove into that one. <laughs> Anyways, let's open. Oh my gosh, how exciting. So first thing on top is the pamphlet that lets you know what the boxes are getting. On one side we have the mini and original boxes. On the other side they give you their exclusive box. They had this during, actually I think they've had it for the past three months. Um, but yeah, this month they have super exclusive like Christmas box, which is really cool. Next, there is a postcard, or Christmas card, and it says, Merry Christmas from Snack Fever. On the back it says, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. May your Christmas sparkle with moments of joy, laughter, and grace. And may the new year be filled with peace and happiness. Thank you for your continued support and best wishes for the holidays. From Team Snack Fever. And it has all their little signatures down here. That's very cute. And the last non-food item we have, I think, um, is the Snack Fever sticker, and it is a Christmas theme this month. I'm so excited for Christmas. We have five days, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, Christmas. So first, we have some Honey Tong Tong. Premium honey flavored potato puffs. Honey butter flavor is very popular in Korea right now. I just, I have to be honest. Honey butter is not my favorite. Oh, the smell of that. Wow. Okay, let's try one. That scares me. It has a weird aftertaste. Oh. Oh, no. Mm, don't like those. Um, they're really potatoey at first, and then it's this weird artificial, but probably not artificial, honey and butter flavor. That's, that's so weird. <laughs> okay. Next. We have cereal choco. Cereal biscuits filled with chocolate. Try having a snack with milk. Okay. So, I will have it with milk after I try one on its own. It's in this really bright box. Really cute. And oh, these smell so chocolatey. Mmm. It's like... What cereal is that? I want to say it's like a Lucky Charms kind of outside cereal. Um, I think they're similar to Crave. I think that's the name of the cereal. If I'll put a picture up um, of the cereal I'm talking about. I think they're similar to that, but the inside is like a actual chocolate. Like... It's soft and like melty and creamy. Very good. I'm gonna be eating these for breakfast. And I think I opened it wrong. I did. Next, we have Waffle Mate soft and thick Belgian style waffles. Okay. Oh god. There's a picture of honey on it. I know what that means. Okay, so there's two packages that are individually wrapped. Let's open it. Mmm. 
those are really good. They're not as crunchy as I expected them. I expected them to be a little more like, um, like ice cream cones. These are really good. Next, we have sweet and crunchy baked biscuit sticks with creamy cheese and chocolate dipping sauce. Cheese and choco pick. So you get to choose if you'd rather have cheese or chocolate. So it's like, um, it's like a yan yan. That is not a good combination. <laughs> so here's the cheese and here's the chocolate. Um... Let's try this. So first, I'm going to try the cheese, just so that if it's really bad, the chocolate will still be there. Okay. What I don't understand is why is the cheese sweet? Is that just this? Why is... The cheese is sweet. Why? Why? You have a nice savory-like flavor. And it's sweet. Oh, okay. Let's try the chocolate. Nice and thick. What if the chocolate's savory? <laughs> the chocolate is alright. I feel like it's a bit grainy, which sounds weird. But, um, yeah, no, not the best. Did not care for the cheese. Do not care for the chocolate. Next, we have Premia Ghana Chocolate. Soft cake with real chocolate, 100% cocoa butter. That sounds good. And there are two. Oh, this looks so pretty. Oh my gosh. Mmm. That was so good. It's kind of like a moon pie, but not at all. <laughs> it's just like chocolate cake with a chocolate cream inside of it. It's really good. Next, we have French pie. Buttery puff pastry pie with sweet apple topping. Okay. The apple topping is sticking. <laughs> okay, so here is what it looks like. It's like really sticky. Um, let's try it. Honestly, I don't really taste the apple at all. It's just ma mainly this really flaky, delicious biscuit stuff. So, it's pretty good. Oh, it's all right. Next, we have Pato cheese flavor. Sandwich cookies that contain cheese. Okay. Hoping that these are going to be like Ritz crackers. Okay. They look promising so far. They actually look like Ritz crackers. <laughs> um... Oh, I swear if this is sweet again. These are, oh, crumbs everywhere. These are all right. They're really good. They're just like two Ritz crackers with a little bit of like easy cheese in them. So pretty good. Next, oh my gosh, I didn't even see... We have a drink by Latte. Latte is like my new favorite brand because their milkies, milkies, 
drink is so good. This is latte or lote or lot lot whatever crushed pear juice made of natural fresh pear. Did you know Korean pear juice can prevent hangover? Oh, well, there you go. Oh, it smells good. It smells kind of like a drink from last month's box. Kind of. Very pulpy. Like pear pulp. Like actual crunch crunch pears. Good flavor. I like it. Next, we have Bio Candy, three different flavors, apple, melon, and peach. Soft candy made out of fresh 1A grade milk. Okay, I got apple and peach, and I'm going to try the peach first. Okay, this is what it looks like. Mmm, wow, it's really soft. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Next, apple. I'm going to see if I can tear this one apart. You can see just how soft it is. That's pretty good. That's awesome. And last but not least, we have Coco Man. Delicious mild chicken flavor instant noodle. In 2011, it was ranked number one noodle in Korea. Well, I'll have to... Let my brother have this because I'm a vegetarian. I don't eat chicken or red meats. Um, but yeah, it says clean, spicy. So, um, I guess it's a clean spiciness as opposed to dirty spiciness. That was the entire snack feeder box for December. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video, and happy almost Christmas. Yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Christmas.